you know, my name is Miss Lisa. We're going to be doing math together this morning. I have all of your names on these cards. So, are you not? All right. So, if I say your name wrong, you can tell me that you can tell me the right way to pronounce it. I'm going to do the best to say your name correctly. Thank you. I also, I normally don't have anybody raise their hands because I like to give everybody time to think. And if you're raising your hands, other people get nervous because they're like, oh, I'm still thinking. And they already know. So I'm going to call you by these cards. If you don't know, you can say, Miss Lisa, I'm really not sure. That's OK. I say, you don't have to know everything. Because if you knew everything, you probably could just go to second grade. We're learning. I don't expect you to know everything, what do I do right? Nothing? But I do expect you to try, right? Yeah. And it's OK if we make mistakes, because you know what? I'm going to tell you a secret. What? Do you know your brain grows more when yeah. you make a mistake? Yeah. I'm big. Yeah, right? So mistakes, I love mistakes, right? Because we can talk about mistakes. Mistakes are awesome. Right? So I want you to try to do your best. And if we make a mistake, it's fine. Yeah. All right, so the first thing, what are we doing today? It says, I can add and subtract two numbers within 10. What does add mean? It means add. Well, well, wait, look. Don't shout at me. I'm going to call a name. All right. Where's, uh, oh, I hope I can. I think this is Tyson. Where's Tyson? He's right there. Tyson, what do you think? Add means if you add something. It makes more stuff. It makes more stuff. Yeah. Can anybody add on? Now you can raise your hand. Can anybody add on to what Tyson said? Probably. It makes more stuff. What is your name? Monica. Monica? What do you think? Micah. Oh, Micah. What do you think? Um, uh, I didn't hear you, sweetheart. Are you still thinking? You want me to come back? You want to think some more? Yeah. All right. What is your name? Jacob. Jacob. What do you think? You're not sure? All right. If I if you raise your hand, you have to be sure, right? And if you don't know, that's okay. Put your hand up. What do you think? What's your name, sweetie? What do you think? She got for me. Makes more stuff. What else could add mean? That's okay. You know what? We're going to pause because we have enough. How about subtract? Subtract. What do you think subtract means? Okay. Kia? Me. Kaya. Kaya. Who's Kaya? Kaya. Is Kai. Okay, Kai. What does subtract mean? It means taking away. It means taking away. So if we're adding, we're getting more. If we're it's subtracting, we're taking away. Can we say that? If we add, it means taking away. If we add, it means making more. more. If we subtract, it means making away. Taking away or making less. All right, that's what we're going to be doing today. All right, let me get the clicker. All right, so on your desk, on your first page, you have this picture. I just want you to look at it. And I want you to think, I don't want you to talk. I want you to think. What do you notice? What do you, shh, don't say anything yet. Give everybody a chance to think. What do you notice? What do you notice? I still don't know how to. I still don't I don't have a name yet. Your name's in here. I'll get there, OK? All right. I'm going to call a name. Heather, where's Heather? Heather, what do you notice? Jacob, what do you see? Two Jacobs. Uh, it's, Jacob with a K. It's this one. Jacob, what do you see? This is spilling out. Oh, it's spilling out. All right. So we have a cup that's spilling some red and yellow dots. Counters. Oh, who said counters? Yeah, they're counters. That's what they are. So, oh, 
Oh, you're all smart. I'm smart for I want you to think about how many yellow counters do you see? Don't shout at me. How many yellow counters do you see? I'm going to try to find a different name. Bristol. Where's Bristol? Bristol, how many yellow counters do you see? Four. Do we agree with Bristol? Yes? Are there four? Yeah. All right. How many red counters? Rhett. Where's Rhett? He's not here. Is that him? Yeah. Oh, and I called his name. He missed it. Okay. Ariel. Where's Ariel? Ariel. Ariel. Where's it? Ariel. Ariel. Are you Ariel? How many red counters do you see? Three. You can look on your page. Can you count them? Yeah. Three. Four. Five. So we have four yellow. How many red? Five. five. Four. So can we can we see, can we add four and five? Yeah. yeah. What, that, what does that mean? Ten. Ten. We put them together? Let's count. Ready? Right. What color do you want to start with? Red. Yellow. Red. Yellow. Red. Yellow. Red. Yellow. We're going to do red. Ready? Let's count. Ready? One, two, three, five. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. now putting some stuff together. So I want you to look at this picture. It's not it's not on your table. Hmm, have you ever seen something like this? Hmm. Well I want you to think about what do you think when you look at this picture? What's it make you think about? Hmm, don't don't shout, don't shout. You have to think. Think. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to ask. Oh, I have to ask someone new. Ariana. Where's Ariana? What do you think about when you see that? It looks like a triangle. It, it looks like a triangle. Why does it look like a triangle? What about it? Because it, oh, triangles have three sides. Oh, how about, whoops, got to call on something different. I keep getting the same names. Gavin, where's Gavin? He's up there. Gavin, what do you think? Uh, I think that these are the, uh, oh. the three circles. There's three circles. All right. Hey, Knox. Oh, what you, I got your name. You're on top again. What are you thinking? Hey, no, I'm going to ask you to close that, because guess what? That's up here. It's not in there. What do you think? Mm, it kind of looks like something you can multiply and mix with. Multiply and mix with? Yeah, a lot of people put a yellow circle there and 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 a yellow circle there you know what? You're pretty darn close, right? Because we're going to, if this is orange, we said red and red and yellow make orange. Yeah. Well, guess what? How many, I got to find my little annotate here. How many, who remembers? Oh, let's see how your memories are. Who remembers how many yellow counters we have? Four. Four. How could we could we draw those? How could we represent this? Sure, we could. We could draw four yellows. We could draw four yellows. Four dots. Or four dots. Four How dots. many reds were there? Five. Five. So what could I? How could I do five for here? Oh, I could draw five. Could I draw five cubes? No. And, or I could write the number five. And who remembers how much we had? All together. Nine. 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 What can I put up here? A nine. nine. I could do a nine. Can I do nine. something else? Nine. Uh, nine stripes. Nine. Oh, nine. so I could nine. do nine, nine cubes. So now that you're looking at that, thinking about what Knox said, now what are you thinking? What do you think?
think that might help us think about? So let's go back. Hmm, which one? Subtraction. Subtraction means what? Taking away. Taking away. So it's. But what did we do with our counters? Add. 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 Must be what? Had five. 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 Four. Four. Let's pause. You're shouting at me. What did we do with these two? Uh, well, and I'm going to call a name that I remember from my cards. Where's Bristol? Me. Bristol, what did we do with these two things? Obviously, we counted them all together. We counted them all together and got nine. So guess what now? You're going to practice with your cubes. All right? But first... Sorry, I'm learning how to use this. We're going to do one together. So I want you, now you can turn your page. What's your name, sweetheart? Elena. Elena, can I steal these? I'll bring them back, I promise. All right. All right. So before we do this, how many cubes do you have? Five. Five. Six. Mm. Let's count them. Ready? What do you 
We could do four here. All right, so we can write a four or we could do what else? Four blocks. Four blocks, go ahead. Key, where's key? Your key, correct? What do you think might go in our last box? Uh, three? A uh, three, why do you think three? Because we started off five and we're subtracting. Oh, so what are you subtracting to get three? Uh, three <coughs> of them down. Okay, let's go back. Remember we had our, what's this called, Key? Full. It's the full or the full. And we took one off and we said half. half. That's part. Half. Well, it's not half, but it is a part. Cool. And then we have how much half. left? Half. Is this the other part? Yeah. yeah. So, Key, if this is the other part, what do you think might go there? Uh, one. The one? one? A one. All right. Why do you think one? Because it was subtracting down to one. Uh, so, did you? what did you subtract? Tell me what you subtracted. Uh, five to four. And so you said five, and you said if we take those away, we have one? All right. So let's put a one here, or one two. So now we're going to look at your second one. But I'm not going to help you as much this time. So now we took one off. All right, I want you to make a hole. Make a hole. Show me a hole. Hold up your hole. Look at Miss Lisa's hole. Look at her hole. She has a whole stick. <laughs> right? So we took one off. We're going to get fancy. What do you think? How many think I might take off? One, two. We, we did want take off two. So now I want you to think you're going to do your next one. See Something wrong, so we're gonna ignore that. So on your next one, I want you to think about what's your hole? What's your what's our hole? What's our hole? The hole. Five. Three, three or five? Five. five. All of it together is five. Where are we gonna put a five? Look at the three. In in our thank you. Where are we gonna put our five? Uh, Braxton. Uh, Where's Braxton? It's Daxton. Daxton. Sorry, I'm doing by memory. Where is that? Right behind. What do you think? Where's our five going to go? Our hole. All of it. On the top. On the top. Bam. Right. Why did he say on the top? Because it's bigger. Because it's our, what's our vocabulary word? Oh. 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 It's our hole. Go ahead. Put your five up there. And now I want you to talk with the person next to you and think about what you think goes in our bottom two circles. Five, right? Yep. Here's a part, here's a part, right? So we walked around, everybody, you got that. So we're gonna put our whole back together. Now I want you to look at number three. Let me, uh, let me move my... Right, number three. Now, I want you to take off three from the top. And I want you to think about what goes here. Woo, I just messed something up. I need help. <laughs> what goes in that top circle? What's our vocabulary word? letter of the day and it sounds like hole but this is a different kind of hole it starts with a w right it's a weird looking word so what what are you putting in your hole how many how many are you putting in that top is is two all we have we is this our hole no what's our hole five five so what's going in the hole spot five i do that Right on. Where do we write our hole? Okay, 
And if you think you know the parts, go ahead. You can start doing that. And we're going to walk around and see. I have two parts in my hands. You can break yours into two parts to help you. Put them back together, and you're going to make your what? Hole. 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 One more time. Put them back together. It's going to make a hole. The top number, pull, part, part. Ask my question. So what do you notice? I want you to look at, these are called number bonds. I want you to look at, what do you notice that's the same about them all? Think, don't shout. What's the same about them all? And I left my card somewhere, so I'm going to take, I have a new, what is your first name? Uh, five, four, four, one. Heather. Heather. Oh, I did ask a Heather. Heather, what do you notice that's the same? Um, because they're both, like, the minus is the same between each other right there. Do you know at the bottom there's a minus, at the top there's a minus, and there's plus off the top, and there's plus at the bottom? Are you looking at these down here? Or are you looking at the circles? Um, these. The math. The, the math, math part. Okay, but don't look at the math part yet. We're going to do the math part. Guess what, though? We've been doing math. We just haven't been doing equations yet. But look at your just the circles, your whole and your two parts. What do they have that's similar? The, that's the same. Fives? Fives! Where are all the fives? On the top. Why are all the fives on the top? Because it's the biggest number. It's the whole. All right, we're going to say it all together. Ready? I can count of three. We're going to tell me what the five represents. It represents one, two, three. The whole. Right? How are they different? How are they different? The last one has a four. Oh. Oh, the last one had a par part of four and one. The first one I think we did also had parts of four and one. Does yeah. it matter which circle I put the four in and which circle There's I put the There's two of each. There's two of each. Right. Do you think it matters if I put the four here and the one here? Could I put the one here and the four there? No. no. Yeah. Let's think about it. So I have four cubes and I have one cube. If I have four cubes first and I put one cube with it, do I have five cubes? Yes. All right. Now let's think about it if I do the one first. I have one cube and I put four cubes with it. Do I still have five cubes? Yes. Does it matter? No. Does it matter? Four and another is still going to give me five. One and four is still going to give me five. Right, so the order doesn't matter when we're putting together, right? All right, so now we're going to look at the, what Heather was talking about. At the bottom of your first one, we had we, our hole. We had our hole was five, and our parts were four and one. So this, what's this sign? An equal. Oh, there is an equal plus. sign. Plus. That's the equal. Plus. 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 What does plus mean? It means at the adding sign. And, right, and add means put together. So what two numbers are we going to put together to make a whole? A five. Four, four and one. A four. 
four and a one. So that's what I want you to do. We're going to make an equation. We're going to say four plus one equals what? Five. five. Equals what? Five. 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 Go ahead. means that 5 is the same as 4 plus 1. They both equal how much? 5. Five. So we have this. That doesn't look like a plus sign. What is that? A minus. A minus, minus. sign. What's the math word? It's not addition. It's, what's the math word? It starts with a s Subtraction. Oh, bam. Nice. High five, you're leaving me hanging. All right, it is a subtraction. So for this one, we had a five, a three, and a two. Now, does it matter if your two's here and your three's here? No. Doesn't matter. So something, take away something is gonna leave us with something. So I want you to think, hmm. I know you were talking about fact families, but I don't know. Did they do subtraction fact families yet? No, we did today. It's the first time we did this. Oh, <laughs> okay. So you learned a little bit about fact families. I want you to think about what we did, right? We had a hole, and we took some away, and then we were left with some. So think about it. We have a hole. We took some away. Whoops, I didn't take enough away. We took some away, and then we had some left. So, hmm. What do you think might have to be the starting number? Five. five. Why do you say five? Because there's a five in the left one. All right, so we're going to put a five here. What, what did we? What did I take away? How many? Two. Two. So five. We took away two, and how many are left? Three. You guys are rock stars. Three. All right. So you have two more on your page. The next one is addition. I want you to see if you can work with some at your table. If you can figure out this equation without my help. All right, for number three, I took three away and we had two, right? So our whole was what? Five. Five. Our parts were? Two and three. Two and three. So when we add, we take our parts and make our whole. So what's our equation for this number bond? Five and three. Does it matter which one I put first, two or three? No. No. So we could do two, and then what does two plus three equal? Five. Five. I had some of my friends put four plus one equals five there. Four plus one, does that equal five? Yeah. It does, but why do you think I said, well, we probably don't want to put four plus one here. Why not? Why did we not want four plus one for this number bond? And those are parts, four and one? Because it doesn't match you. It doesn't match it. Is four and one our part? No. No, three and two are our parts. All right, so then for the very last one, we had pick away, right? So what's our home? Five. 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 And then what are, what are our parts? Two and three. Four and three. Four and four. So if we're taking away, what do you think? 
think I need my first. This, sorry, this is wrong up here. What do you What do you think my first number? We want to use these three numbers. What do you think I might start with? Five. Five. Our whole, right? We're going to start with our whole. What are we going to take away? Four. four. We could take away four. If we take away four, how many do we have left? One. We took one. away four. One. One. Did anybody do five minus one? Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's okay. What's that equal? We take four. one away. Four. Four. Awesome. I only did five minus one. Awesome. Two. Your brains are hurting. This is the first time you've seen this, huh? Right? Yeah. You guys are doing awesome. Guess what? We're gonna think a little bit more. But we're done with our cubes. We're gonna we're gonna switch into something else. So put your cubes up on the top of your desk. I'm gonna use the document camera. I know you showed me, but okay, you're fine. Okay. All right. So while Mrs. Willis is getting the document camera. <coughs> I want you to think about our number bonds. Did that help you write the equation, the number bonds? Yes. How, how did that help you? By getting counted up and counting down. Okay, what else? How does the number bond separate the numbers? So what are, the, what are, what are those called? What's our top circle called? Our all. Oh, it's called a hole, right? And then the two circles underneath are the Heart. hearts. Hearts. So our number bond lets us know what two parts we can put together. What's a what's a math word for putting together? It's a, a plus. We do. It's a plus sign. What's the math word? It starts with a. Right? So we can put our two parts together to add to get our whole, right? Or we can take our whole and take a part away. And then we're left with the other part. part. All right. So now I'm going to just toss. What are these called? Dot. Counting dots. Counters, two color counters. Remember what we did in the beginning when we started this and I had you notice and wonder? So I want you to think about how many how many yellow counters do I have? Three. How many blue counters do I have? Three. Red. And so I want to think about we're gonna make a number bond. So what goes up here? Yellow. The yellow. Red. Blue. Red. Blue. What's our hole? The hole. What's our hole? The, the hole. Red. Red. Yellow. Red. All of it. So Six. how much is all of it? Let's count. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, five. Oh, six. Oh. All right. I'm going to ask you to raise your hand. Don't shout out. One part. One part. Hmm. Go ahead. What's your name? Okay. Go ahead. Give me one part. Yellow. yellow. Can we put a number to the yellows? Yellow is one part. How many yellows are there? Three. Awesome. Who can give me the other part? Spider Man. What's your name? Aiden, what's the other part? We got the yellow three. What's the other part? Uh, uh, red. Red. Can we put a number to it? Two. No? Yeah. How many? Two. Two. All right. Challenge. Turn to the person next to you. I want you to make an addition equation with this. And I'm going to change my color so you can actually see it. Uh, talk to your partner. What do you think you can put together to make a whole? How are we going to make this equation? Three plus two equals five. Awesome. All right, ready? Drum roll. Challenge question. Yes. 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 
to your partner. How could we do that? Holy cow. We 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 don't
too. Nice. All right, this table, what'd you learn? Uh, how, to how to subtract. All right, last thing. Do I have one minute or no? Okay, last thing. Turn to your partner and tell them. When you think about the number bond, that circle at the top, tell them what the vocabulary word for that number at the very top is called. Turn and tell them, what was that vocabulary word? Number at the very top of the number bond is one, two, three, five! It was five! Yes, what's the math word? Oh. oh, so I have a really weird question. Do you think it's always gonna be five as your whole? No. No. What if I have four cubes only? Sometimes then this is my whole, right? The whole means how much we have or maybe it's or maybe it's all. on all, in all. All right, last question. Two circles at the bottom. We have our whole, and they share the same name. Tell your partner, What's the, what is this called? When we break them apart, what is this called? Um, we have the hole and we be break it. What do we have? Well, we did. We Five. What's the math word? We have hole and heart. Heart. And what's the other side called? Heart. 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 Hole. Heart. Heart. Good job. All right. Bottom number. We have the hole and then we have the part and the part. The part and the part. Give your brains a kiss. Yeah.